Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel and today I have another Aldi food shop. If you're new here, my name is Amy. I have three children, three girls, all aged five and under. We are a family of five, so we do buy quite a bit of food. This one today cost me just over £100. Just to add as well, I am following Slimming World, so a lot of the meals that we make are Slimming World friendly. Try and lose the baby weight of all three of them. <laughs> I am also in the middle of filming a What I Eat in a Week on Slimming World, so if you're interested in that, please give me a subscribe, or if you just want to be nosy and see how much weight I lose in a week, <laughs> we're here for that too. As always, I will put the sin value of the foods in the description box, so I'm not babbling on. So, back to my old school list. <laughs> the meals that I bought for this week are cottage pie, sausage casserole, going to do a batch of chicken and rice, fish and chips and burgers. And then my receipt this week I spent £103.25. pence. Again, loads and loads and loads of food for us to eat all week. Oh hello, she's just in the corner. Oh is that a wave? There are you. She's been a good girl eating her little crisps while I'm filming this. And yeah, yes. <laughs> So I got one of these chicken shawarma, shawarma <laughs> from the grab and grow bit. So I normally get the bang bang chicken and the Korean beef. I really enjoy those ones. And the really low sin as well. Good to take out with you if you're going anywhere. And this was a new one. So I've not seen this before. So I thought I'd get it to try it. See if it's nice. Because I know the other ones are really nice. And then fruit wise, we've got some pomegranate seeds, some strawberries, some grapes, and some raspberries. Are you talking to? Some bananas. I've got some squeezy garlic to squeeze into every meal that I make. And the cherry tomatoes are for my chicken and rice. Onions and peppers. So for the chicken and rice that I make, I use an onion or two, some cherry tomatoes and peppers and then chicken and then the Mexican rice. Then got some casserole bags for my sausage casserole. I remember on the first food shop video that I did, I was trying this for the first time and oh my goodness, it is beautiful. It is so, so nice. So it's become a firm staple in our house. So I've got two of those to put in for the slow cooker. Then... <laughs> Then I've got some lettuce for our burgers. I'm not a big salad fan, but I will force feed myself some lettuce <laughs> for a bit of speed. Then I've got a pack of potatoes, jacket potatoes for lunches through the week. This sausage casserole seasoning mix is one that I throw in to the slow cooker with this. Really, really nice. Mashed potato for my cottage pie. So I do a lazy cottage pie. Bag it all in the slow cooker and then I will cook this, spoon it on top, put cheese on top and then bang it in the oven. Oh, you're so noisy. Should we put you to bed? She's laughing like no mommy. Right, I'm going to put her to bed and then come and carry on because she's distracting. <laughs> Milks, so I've got blue milk for the girlies and green, not green, shred. <laughs> Red milk for me, we've already got some green left, so didn't need to buy any of that today. Yogurts, I've got some of these lemon Greek style yogurts for me. Yogurts for the girlies. Uh, these sausages is what I use for the sausage casserole. I only used one pack last time and it needed a bit more. So I've got two packs of those to put in there. Plastic cheese for our burgers. I've got some chicken for my chicken and rice, obviously. Some ham for the girlies if they want a ham sandwich when they're absolutely starving when they come in from school. Cheese, I've got some lighter cheese for me and just some normal cheese for everybody else. Butter, I'll not be eating that. Lovely butter. Butter on bread. Oh, stop. Eggs because I fancy some pancakes one morning. So I'm going to make pancakes. Treats then, I've got some jammy wheels, some jives and some shortcake biscuits this week. Just to put in our treat box. Tins. This soup is really, really nice and it's only two and a half sins. So for like a quick, easy lunch, I used to take this to work with me. Or, you know, if you're just starving and can't wait, really nice. Then I've just got some beans and some spaghetti. 
I got some pink pickled onions and I'm not really sure why. I just picked that up. Let's hope they're nice. I'll put it on the lettuce for my burgers and pray that it's nice. Uh, some tuna for some tuna pasta. I'll probably have that for lunch one day this week. These as well. These are brill. The duck one's my favourite. They're just like pot noodle style. Um, but these are really low sin as well. So again, great to have in the cupboards if you just need something to grab quick. Or, you know, sometimes when you have your dinner and you're just not satisfied. Or I'm not anyway. <laughs> I might have one of these like a bit later just to put me on for dinner. Then I got some melts. We only needed one bag crisps this week. We've still got some left. So wholemeal bread. So this is like the cheapo, cheapo one. But this is the only one that I've seen where you can, you know, that's not like the tiny loaf where you can have two slices as your healthy extra B on some of them. So I've got that just for me. I'll put that in the freezer and just get out what I need when I fancy some bread or toast or sandwich or whatever. I have forgot to buy everyone else some bread. <laughs> so I'm going to have to call to the shop again, but it's not the end of the world. I've, I've got these to try for the kids. I thought, you know, like after school, again, I'm hungry, I'm hungry. I thought I would take on one of them with me on the school run and then some brioche buns that are burgers apple juice for girlies on the morning and then freezer stuff picked up some chunky cord these again are really lovely they're only 219 calories really low sin make a nice fish and chips pizza i purposely only bought one this week so that i'm not tempted to eat it and then I've just got some sweet corn and some peas because we'd run out. Some paracetamol, some toilet bowl, fizz and fresh. Don't know if these are any good. Pink peony. Hopefully they smell really nice. Make the bathroom smell nice. I've, I've gone off, haven't I? Gone off my freezer stuff without mentioning this. So I got this salted caramel ice cream. 330 calories per tub. Um, a quarter of a tub, 83 calories. So I thought I would have this with some strawberries for like dessert. I'm looking forward to that tonight. Back to down here wherever I jumped away. Just got a refill for the re-diffusers. I've got one of these in there on sweet from an organic one. So I thought I'd just top that up. So I'm at floor wipes. Oh my goodness, she's made a right mess down there. Ignore that. Baby wipes, a couple of packs of them. I needed some more fabric softener. I've got some squash, apple and strawberry. That's our favourite one. And then some kinds of pop because I cannot diet without fizzy pop. So I've just got some orange one and some ZX Cola. I feel like that features in my videos. I love a lot. I always seem to be drinking a ZX Cola, but I like it. And then shimmy over to the other side. And then as well as that, I just got a big pack of nappies. Some bleach, some toilet rolls, and a big bag of dog food. Again, ignore the mess, messy children. I'm going to put all this food shop away and clean the floors again for the fourth time today. Thank you all for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Please give me a like and subscribe if you have. It will mean the world to me. I'm so close to a thousand subscribers now, so please. <laughs> Thank you all for watching again, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.